Hello, it is Anne from the Arizona Trail. Here I am on the Arizona Trail. There's a bit of the trail right there. And that is the bridge over the Rio de Flag. I am just outside the city of Flagstaff at about mile 280, or 588. <laughs> 588, um, I am meeting my family shortly. Any time now, they might come walking down the trail to walk in to meet me and walk back to a trailhead where I will go home for a few days and uh, get some R&R &R and eat some good food and get organized for the miles ahead. Um, and the Rio de Flag is one of the few flowing water sources that is um, encountered in northern Arizona and sadly it comes out of the city of Flagstaff wastewater treatment plant so it is not water that one can drink um, but not in the, not at this location anyway but it's very pretty nice little bridge here so it's been very interesting walking along passage 32 um, I crossed Interstate 40 and the railroad a little while ago and just approaching Flagstaff from the east because this this way that I'm coming through Flagstaff goes way around to the east through a kind of skirts along the edge of Walnut Canyon National Monument and then approaches the east side of town from the east. So it's just been a different perspective um, and it's been very nice. It's been great being up on the Mogollon Rim. The walking has been so much easier than it was down south, so it's just kind of nice to have a little bit easier walking and be able to walk more like 12 to 15 miles a day. Before I got up on the rim, I was consistently averaging 10 miles a day, some days more, some days less, but it was an average of 10 miles a day. And I thought I would do more, and I think it's a combination of that I really just take my time to enjoy places and birds and wildlife and rocks and scenery and I take a lot of pictures and I really just like to stop and just be with a place or a critter, be it a horny toad or a lizard or a Gila monster, whatever it might be. Um, I'm also not a super lightweight hiker, so I'm sure if I was carrying like 10 less pounds, you know, if I got rid of some of the items that I really like to have, I could certainly move faster. But I've really enjoyed the way that I've done it, um, and it's um, just been really an amazing, amazing journey to spend so much time in the wilderness just, um, you know, kind of living in the wilderness has been really awesome. So, a couple more miles and I get off the trail for a few days, so signing off from just outside Flagstaff. <laughs>